Welcome back to another video. Um, like you saw in that previous clip, this is my morning routine. This is actually my new 5 a.m. morning routine. I would say every morning is not the same. Some days I just want, I need some extra sleep. Some mornings it's just, okay, let's get it going. But I would say when I do wake up at 5 a.m., it kind of helps me during the day of getting up and getting stuff done. Um, first things first, before the kids get up, I really try to get that workout in. Um, does it happen all the time? No. Um, I would sadly say um, this week that I filmed this um, was not a very, I want to say like it's a bad week. It was just mentally was not a good week. So, but I would say 5 a.m. helps me get myself mentally ready for the day. But I'm not saying that you should get up at 5 a.m. every day. Heck no. <laughs> Same at 7 a.m. That's my jam right there. Okay. <laughs> but um, get my Fitbit on. I actually haven't worn my Fitbit most of that week because my kids lost my charger. So I had to thank God for Amazon. Thank God for Amazon that I had to order me another charger. And when I ordered it, they had one that was $5.99 for one charger and the $7.99 for two chargers. I was like, give me the two chargers because just in case this happens again <laughs> so but ever since i got it charged up ready to go it's been on my wrist but yeah but that's the first thing i do i try to get my workout clothes on um get pull my hair up and put my fitbit on and just turn some lights on because yeah it's dark i will say in, the, in my house i don't have the best lighting but gotta do what you gotta do what you gotta work with so but um First things first, I'm getting me some ice for my water for my workout. Um, I've been trying so, so hard to drink more water. Has it been working? No. Um, I do say I do have a Sprite every other day. Some days I'm just like, I'm strictly on water all day. And some days I'm like, I'm craving that caffeinating drink. So I stick with Sprite. Um, I want to drink a soda. Now you know, you know, once in a while you gotta have that one dark soda, and which like a Dr Pepper or Coke once in a while, but rarely I want those. Um, use I just stick with Sprite. But I was like, let me get my water in, let me get it going, ready for my workout. Um, I would say on um, workouts, um, I use I go on my YouTube. Um, and I have a playlist on my YouTube and of different yoga um, sessions, um, different workouts to do, different meditation videos. So I have a category, it's called workout. So I, I know where to look and any of my favorite workouts or any of my favorite yoga videos. I go strictly on it, find what I need. Um, this particular day I was trying a new video. It was new, I liked it. I think it's because I'm a dance. I like to dance, so I like something fun. But sometimes you do have to actually work out and do those trickly workout moves. Now I'm going a little funny because I'm doing this like, like speed up. But this is like a warm up, so that's why I wasn't moving as much. <laughs> but the funny thing is, my Fitbit told me later on my phone that they recognized that um, exercise, and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> that was no. I never had that happen before, but. Yep, I'm jiggling, wiggling, so, but I try to do this early in the morning, so my kids like doing it with me, but it's just easier when the kids are not around that I could just literally concentrate on the workout and myself and what they're doing and what the moves and stuff like that, but sometimes, you know, sometimes you can't do it in the morning, sometimes you gotta do it later when your kids are up, so it's just what it is. Um, then I get my yoga mat out ready for meditation because I would say meditation has helped a little bit like 
I want to say a little bit, but it helps like mentally just to get myself like focused and everything. So I try to meditate in the morning. <laughs> um, it's new. I just started doing this like this year of meditation. Um, I've seen a lot of people who have mental health. I wouldn't say issues, but like it helps mentally. Even if you don't have a mental illness, it helps even for the people, you know, just to get ready for the day. Now, I had to wake up sleepy head. Look at that mess. <laughs> I love it all. But I had to wake her up. She wants, she's been wanting to get up early lately. So, but I think it's because I've actually, she actually been wanting to eat breakfast in the morning. She used to not want to eat breakfast in the morning. I will say that that child never wanted to get up earlier. And I got her some Mickey Mouse waffles. Um, but she used to not be like that. She used to like wake up right before we need to go and I get her dressed and everything. But now she really wants to get up and eat something. So is every morning like that? No. <laughs> Sometimes I'm running late and I'm like, okay, let's get going. <laughs> so, but I need to get my cup of coffee. I try to drink my cup of coffee while my oldest one is like enjoying her breakfast. Because after the oldest one is up, I'm usually trying to get stuff done with her. I mean, the youngest one is up. Usually I get stuff done with her and get um, stuff done around the house. Um, but I, not every day. I mean, it's mom life. Sometimes I say that for dad life. So, because sometimes you just like you get busy, your kids get you busy and you just forget about your cup of coffee. So, I want to say now when I do actually finish my cup of coffee. As an accomplishment. <laughs> so, but here I am waiting for my cup of coffee to get done. So I am told myself, okay, let me get the la not laundry. Sorry, guys. It's either laundry or dishes I'm doing. Okay, it's always every day or day. <laughs> I'm either doing laundry or dishes. It's just how it is. Um, but I was getting the dishes unloaded from the dishwasher because you know during the day it's so much easier especially if the dishes are unloaded when they're unloaded it's easier like you take the dishes that you're using that day and just put it straight in the, wa the dishwasher see I'm saying wash machine see I'm thinking of laundry uh, <laughs> we could strictly put it in the dishwasher and once that's all full and everything you can turn it on I would say I really don't like unloading it I don't mind loading it I just don't like unloading it. Maybe that's the same way with laundry. I just don't like, like washing. Okay, you got to, if you want to have clean clothes. Drying, okay, that makes sense because you gotta have dry clothes to put back up. Folding, okay, you're going too far. I'm not putting this stuff up. <laughs> so, but I would say that, but um, I had to suck a little bit of stuff that the kids had. It's not washable in the dishwasher, so I couldn't put it in there to sanitize or anything. I had to soak it and clean it up a little bit. But once I get done with that, I am going to work on my journal, which is I got from Aware. I will have that link below. You can use my um, discount code for it or anything on their website. And then my to-do list that I bought from Amazon for my to-do list of what I need to get done that day. And I've been lately not writing a big, huge list lately. I've been strictly like making sense kind of things. Like, you know you're gonna make the beds. You know you're gonna like, there's something like maybe you need to do the load laundry that day, put it on there. Or you know you gotta take trash out, but not put nothing crazy on there like a lot of things you know you're not gonna accomplish. So I have been doing pretty good on my to-do list lately. I would say that like lately my to-do list has been reasonable because I used to put a lot on my to-do list and I didn't even get half of it done and then I felt like, very bad because I was like I didn't get none of it done I didn't get all of it done and you know me I like chicks for some of my stuff so so since this year I've been more more realistic when it comes to my to-do list I'm like okay I know I can make all the beds I know I can straighten up the house I know I can do this and that so and then I ate me a little bit of something you I'm not extremely hungry in that morning but I ate a little something I made a little yogurt because I'll eat later 
um because that's when i really get hungry is when later in the morning but early in the morning i'm just like let me put something on my stomach but here i am trying i'm gonna make my daughter's lunch she has been at least once a month she'll find something on their lunch menu that she won't and lately it's at least been once a month that she's been eat hot lunch up there but most of the time i am making lunch for her and I, it's always been like that at her school so but um just going through her folder real quick make sure i didn't overlook anything that needs to be you can see she has a christmas movie on don't i mean it's you can see i already have my christmas stuff now so she's just been lately into i mean we have disney plus but she's been lately watching a lot of christmas stuff on it but once we get ready and gather, yes, I am that mom. I will walk in. I will walk. I will go to my car, drop my kid off in my slippers. That's how I roll. <laughs> and this particular day, my car was iced up, so we had to really we had to wait a little bit for my windshield to thaw out. That's the fun thing, not having like a cover over your car. You have to wait for it to thaw out, but. I'm just taking her to school. My youngest one is at home, and also don't worry, she ain't alone. But um, her dad's at home with her, but she still sleeps. She sleeps a little bit. She sleeps at least nine o'clock, unless she's really ready to get up early in the morning. But usually eight o'clock or nine o'clock is when she wakes up. Um, so I'm thankful my husband's home in the morning, so I don't have to disturb her. I don't have to wake her up, get her dressed. It's just. I could just get my oldest one situated, get her to school, and bam. I don't have to worry about my, you know, my youngest one getting her ready and everything. So, but once I get back home, I try to do this when my youngest one still asleep. Sometimes you can hear in my voiceovers, you know that means I didn't make it. <laughs> but I try to get a lot of my work done right after I get back from dropping her off. And you, of course, enjoy my cup of coffee because let me taste. <laughs> once I get started cleaning something or doing anything else, I would say, I forget about it. But then, uh, you see, I told you I would come back for breakfast myself. These burritos are breakfast burrito. And the funny thing is, my husband's company he works for makes these burritos. So, ever since he started working for this company, we've been buying burritos. Because they um, do chimichangas, burritos, and quesadillas. Um, frozen, not the ones that enter in the freezer section. So, ever since then, we've been eating them, baby. He makes they have these breakfast kinds, so we've been eating them. Here's Sleeping Beauty. I woke her up. You can see she's moving slow. She is me. <laughs> that she is my twin, I will say. But I made her some waffles. Um, but she, she, unlike her sister, she's ready to eat in the morning. She's ready to have something to drink. She's ready to have it ready. Usually I try to get her food ready before I even get her out of the crib. So she will soon have a big girl bed one day. We're still trying to probably drain it. it go on well? Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, I have a very stubborn child. <laughs> but I will say my oldest one to get potty drained until about two months after she was three already. And she... My youngest one's two and a half, so we're starting early, so I don't want, I'm not getting too stressed about it, because I'm like, my youngest one was three when she finally got body changed, so, but once I get some work done and get my oldest, my youngest one up, I make the beds. I love when all the beds are made. The house to be trashed and dirt, like, not dirty, but like everything everywhere, but if their beds are made, it makes me feel better. <laughs> Um, usually my oldest one actually um, used to make her bed in the morning, but she has gotten a little slack on her, I'm for sure. <laughs> so I've been doing it lately. Um, she needs to get back in that routine of doing it herself, but she used to um, do it herself. Um, it was one of her chores, but lately I've just either let it be or, or just... I make it up. That's just how it's been lately. This particular day, they had a suitcase because they went to spend a night with their grandparents. Again, I always say that on this video. But usually, my parents want them. I don't ask. They want them. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> That's only because they do. I tell them no because I'm like, I got some stuff planned for them or I just want them near me. So, <laughs> but, um, 
I'm just unpacking their suitcase. I'm like, let me get this over with. I don't know what it is. Anything about unpacking a suitcase, it's like, it's a chore. But I was like, let me get it unpacked because soon I'll have to do their laundry. And I'm like, I don't want to be doing, putting up their laundry on top of putting up their stuff in their suitcase. So I was, <laughs> yeah. But once I get done with my do my oldest daughter's room, I make up my youngest daughter's room, which is not bad. She she mostly goes in her older, uh, older sister's room and messes it up. That's why her, her room is so messy all the time. But I'm putting up clothes for her and then I'm gonna make her bed. Once I got done with my daughter's rooms, I was like, let me get my rest of my house straight up. <laughs> um, got my dining room, not my dining room table, Lord, my kitchen table, um, cleaned up, picked up, um, and I actually wiped it down because it was actually dirty from the night before. I guess I didn't clean it well. So I was like, let me clean it good. I ate off this table. I've done work on this table. Also, my daughter does her homework on this table. So I was like, let me wipe it down make it look nice and because i will say it's somewhat of a catch-all but i try not to let it be like that the rest of the day i try to like okay am i gonna catch this jacket but this jacket's about to go up or am i caught something else and i just put it on the table real quick i was like nope i'm gonna find a home for it so i will say i try to not let it be a catch-all um but once i got done with the kitchen table moved on to the kitchen doing a little few little things um since after breakfast and everything it kind of, i want to say it gets messy now towards the dinner time it starts getting messy in here <laughs> so i try to stay on top of it but i will say soon i will do a daily cleaning routine um show you what i do in the morning i'm kind of showing you here what i do but i don't usually do laundry in the morning i told myself let me do laundry this morning and get i was trying really hard to get make beds do everything because i know once i take a shower my body's gonna relax and be a little lazy afterwards because my body would be like relaxed and didn't want to like i want to say be not be duck be, be <laughs> the rest of the day so i was like you know what i really want to get this done let me do this done before i take a shower and the shower gonna be like my i want to say i wore because i really needed a shower because i had to work out that morning but just like no okay i got all this done i can relax let the shower relax me so but um i was like let me get this done um but I would say laundry is not my daily thing. I try to make that as a weekly thing. But sometimes when you get behind, it takes some days to get, catch up. <laughs> but, um, but I will soon have a clean with me, a daily routine. And then I'll have a clean with me weekly routine it's coming soon. But once I take a shower and get my stuff together, I brush my teeth again, um, I do some skincare. I do I use Tula a lot. I just order me some more stuff because I'm about to run out of my acne one. Now, it's been doing beautifully when it comes to my acne. I have a problem with acne. Ever since I had my second child, I've been having a problem with acne. It's just a hat. It's just... And that's the best that I found yet. Then I'm putting some hair. I wouldn't say a hair mask, but it's like it can go on my hair and it stays. Um, I bought it just like just make it healthier a little bit. It has worked. So this particular day, I think I put too much because the next day I had to wash my hair again because it was just mm, I, it was no. <laughs> but but I hope you like these kind of this kind of video. Give me a thumbs up. If you do, and I'll make some more routine kind of videos. Um, also, if you like my content, 
please hit that subscribe button so you can see future videos um but i hope you enjoyed this video i did talk a lot in this one <laughs> anybody who likes people who talk in their videos hope you enjoy this one but i will see y'all next time in my next video guys see y'all later bye